What's going on, fellow humans and resellers? It's his I, James, ReductionAgency.com, 20 plus years selling on eBay. And here comes Vern. Vern, Vern, Vern. They just went out front, got their treats. Courtney's probably still eating on her, so she'll be down shortly. <clears throat> Time to get to shipping, though. Got some stuff that sold today. It's weird. It's almost like the number, the money made, doesn't match up with the item sold. Now it looks, looks quite short. So I'm kind of... Oh, it could have been uh, the first of the month, so it could have been... It could have been uh, eBay fees coming out, probably, maybe. Maybe that's what it is. That's possible. Or at least the, the store, the anchor store cost. Comes out around the third or fourth, so that's probably what it was. All right, let's get into this and get it crack a lacking. All right, as I've told you many times, you always look for two-on-one albums, CDs, or cassettes. Because um, you can probably make some money here. This one's only a $10 one. But hey, still, if you can get it for a quarter, 50 cents. I'm going to Bruce, Mississippi. Hey, Bruce, that's my dad's name. And Bruce Jr. was my brother's name, who passed in 2016, which led to my dad moving in. And he passed Christmas morning. All right, we've got new and old gospel CD on the Blue Note label. Sold for $10, going to Connecticut. Big Tuck and Texas Tycoons, another one of my Hastings CDs. Clarence item sold for 5 bucks. headed over to England. Bell Bib de Beau, Poison. 45 sold for $8, heading to Washington. Immature, tear it up, cassette single. Hands hey, Bay kids. Uh, sealed. Sold for nine dollars, head to San Diego, California. All right, Bruce Willis, The Return of Bruno cassette. This is another one I probably got hundreds of sealed in storage. Uh, sold for five dollars, head to Walnut Creek, California. U2 Rattle and Hum Record Club version. Sold for five dollars, headed to Indianapolis, Indiana. All right, we got this Beethoven five CD set going to Puerto Rico. Uh, sold for $70. Very nice. Biggity bam. All right, Tequila Army style hat. Sold for six bucks. Headed to Orlando, Florida. I knew this one wouldn't last long. So I got the Master's Visor. Sold for $10. Headed to Newcastle, Indiana. I just put this one up too. Uh, going to Norway. Sold for $10. Sure, Kane Train, Maui, Hawaii. I love it on days I can leave the door open because they just wear themselves out. <laughs> All righty, what's up next? Southwest Industries, no. That must be part of a lot. And I think those are part of a lot. Hold on a minute. Well, I guess it's time. Are you ready for a hat lot? Yeah. All right, these three hats sold for $27 and they're headed to France. We got Grant's farm, very nice condition on that trucker hat. Gateway City International and uh, New Smyrna Beach. Something, I don't know. You know I can't pronounce jack crap. <laughs> Three hats going to France. Yep. Are you ready for another hat lot? Yeah. Southwest, Southeast International. And, Good. It's forgive me. It's like late. <laughs> Southeast industrial equipment, and we've got uh, this H and M brand beige tan hat. I'm going to Massachusetts. Both of them together sold for fifteen dollars. All right, we got this blank trucker hat. 
been in the store over two years. Uh, took an offer for five bucks. Headed to Wisconsin. My unknown ego logo. And um, the person emailed me and told me what it was, but I can't remember. But uh, they bought it for eight bucks and it's headed to New Hampshire. And I think this fact that I'm doing this so late, I don't feel like I have to rush and get this video posted. Uh, it's really taking a lot of st <laughs> like stress and off my mind. So she, as I've said uh, in the comments on the community that my videos are going to be about 24 hours behind. Just so I don't feel like if it's late at night and I'm shipping, I don't have to stand in there and wait for it to upload, make a thumbnail and all that and spend another you know, 30 to 40 minutes doing that when I just want to go to bed. <laughs> so, uh, so making that change has, uh, just freed me up a lot of, uh, stress, I guess you could say, or, or like anxiety, maybe, maybe that's a better word, anxiety. But anyway, all right. Also, I was going to bring back the thrifting in a Porsche today, but <laughs> I just went over there real quick and jetted out real quick as there maybe 40 minutes so i only found like two cassettes and a Def leopard journey t-shirt from 2018 so i'm like eh, no point in really making, <laughs> making a video on this i talked myself out of it so i'm gonna try to start doing that again too when i go to my honey hole but anyway titles hat going up to canada and sold for nine dollars all right i've already got one of these so i did not need to keep this one I mean, it is my size St. Louis Blue Stanley Cup Champs shirt headed up to Kansas City, Missouri. Sold for $12.50. All right, this is going to Buffalo, Missouri. Never heard of it. Uh, sold for $7.27. And uh, that's it. Brad Paisley beat the summer tour t shirt. All right, we just got a St. Louis t shirt. Been in the store over two years. Sold for $7.50. Going to Humble, Texas. I have never found this brand before. I found it for a buck, so I just grabbed it. I'm like, because it feels like good quality. And I'm like, well, that's some cool print. You have Social Tourist on the sleeves, and that's the brand. Greetings from the algorithm. The views here are amazing. So I thought that was a pretty now-ish type of brand, probably. And uh, it sold pretty quick. Sold within 24 hours, actually. And it's going to Sugarland, Texas, and they bought it for $25. Cuddles is now the keeper of the big poly bags. And now I need to check to see how much he's going to cost to ship since that new uh, pricing update. I need to really do my homework and see what things are going to cost me to ship now. These bigger items, because I got about three skateboards I need to list, but I don't know if it's worth it anymore. Anyway, all right, I gotta pack this up. All right, we got this cool vintage Chicago Cubs hat. Sold for $13.50, headed to Phoenix, Arizona. All right, I picked up this vintage Polaroid at the Benz. Polaroid 360. And it's got some uh, picture postcards, blanks, so you can make some, I guess. Got the booklet and everything. Uh, didn't sell for much, only sold for $15. So, and that's going to Portland, Oregon. Great. Going all the way there. The high, One of the higher places to go. Oh, that's a nice way to... Might go over the $15 I charged. All right. Let's just do some pooling here. Next up, we've got a bad address I have to fix. So I picked this up. I picked this up at the Honey Hole for $2.00. So, pretty cool game here. And it ended up selling for $31.50. Right, this is another one of the shirts given to me by Adrian's girlfriend. Uh, the pink tank top. So, cost, cost me nothing. Uh, sold for $9, headed to Indiana. Alright, going to South Carolina, we've got Romeo and Juliet on vinyl. Sold for $5. I knew this wouldn't last. I also have a dark blue one under armor. These usually sell pretty quick and these were nice and clean. Uh, sold for $7, headed to Harrison, Ohio. Alrighty. Um, two different people bought these, so 
they both sold within like 15 minutes of listing them this evening. Jimmy Buffett changes in latitude, sold for $10, going to Baltimore, Maryland. And then we got Neil Young after the gold rush, sold for $10, going to Buford, Georgia. All right, we've got Ed Edgar Winter, Frankenstein 45, sold for $7, headed to Wisconsin. I know so many of you guys said that you want to get down there and lay with them. <laughs> so I'm teasing you with, with the, I'm hooked. I'm teasing you with the video. Seen them lay there. All right. I'm going digging. Some babies. All right. King's Liquor. Lounge and Liquor. Lake of the Ozarks. All right, it's hassle for 1450 headed to Sandown, uh, New Hampshire. <laughs> Thank my abbreviations. Brain fart. All right, we're going to E65. We're looking for Nas. If you see it, yo. Because I'm blind tonight. I'm blind tonight. That could be a good song title. I'm blind tonight. And it's making me feel alright. I'm blind tonight. Dad, where is this? You know, I am... I, was gonna, I knew it was a promo and it probably had somebody else on as you trying to say that. <laughs> Alright, so I was gonna just give up and try to try tomorrow. Alright, Nas and Nature promo cassette sold for five dollars. Headed to Flora, Illinois. Alright, I got a vintage Bass Pro hunting hat. Sold for ten dollars, headed up to Iowa. All right, he's ready for bed. He ready for belly rubs. He ready for bed. Mm -hmm. Yeah, my tired babies. All right, let's go to bed, kiddos. All right, lights off. All right, thanks everybody for watching. And I started up a TikTok, but I don't think I have it linked below yet. I will try to do that if it's not already there. Uh, just doing like some of the shorts on the high dollar stuff that I do and throwing them up on TikTok and also with the uh, what I'm listing up on TikTok. So also I'm doing it up on YouTube also. So but anyway, if you want to follow me on TikTok, you can do that too. So see you guys in the next video. Let's go kiddos.